hi my amazing family welcome back to my channel in this video i'm gonna prepare an amazing hair butter and i'm gonna tell you how i'm gonna use it if you wanna know how to do that keep watching the first ingredient that i'm gonna add is amla Amla is being used to treat all types of hair loss. It's rich in vitamin C. It can help with itchy scalp, dandruff. When you apply it on your hair, it will help you have stronger hair and it will prevent dryness. So if you want to stop breakage, this is something that you can try out on your hair. Next, I'm adding about one teaspoon of hibiscus powder, one teaspoon of moringa powder, and I'm also going to add one teaspoon of fenugreek powder. Now I'm gonna add two cups of oil. I added avocado and olive oil. And after that, I'm going to add about one eighth cup of dried rosemary leaves. I'm gonna mix it really, really well and I'm gonna let it infuse for two days. The longer you keep it, the better. There is two ways that you can prepare this oil. You can just let it infuse like that without heat or you can just warm it up on very low fire just to make the process a little quicker. Two days later, I am just going to filter the oil. This treatment is really powerful. It has hibiscus. Hibiscus is great to restore the health of your hair. It can reactivate all the dormant follicles, which means if you add it to your hair regimen over time, you will realize that your hair is fuller and it will also make your hair very soft and control breakage. It also has fenugreek. Fenugreek seeds can make your roots stronger, which will prevent hair fall. It can repair damaged hair and prevent split ends. It's also a great ingredient and we have it in there. I can't say good enough about rosemary. Rosemary is amazing. If you want hair growth, try rosemary on your hair. Rosemary is rich in nutrients for the hair. It promotes blood circulation. It has anti-inflammatory properties. When you use rosemary on your hair, it will really help you grow your hair fuller. And it's very, very beneficial for those with thin hair. So if you're looking to grow longer and thicker hair, try rosemary on your hair. Here I have my amazing oil right now on a separate cup i am going to add my butters i added cocoa butter mango butter and shea butter i didn't really measure the butter but i can say that i put there around three large tablespoons okay and now i'm adding about one and a half cup of the oil that i just prepared now i'm just gonna transfer it to the fire so i can melt the butter i'm preparing this treatment because my wash day is coming you know that i wash my hair every three weeks with the cornrows so i'm about to wash my hair i wanted something very strong to apply on my hair so that's why i prepared this treatment i am going to use it as a pre poo and you will see that now i'm transferring about half of the treatment into another cup because i'm gonna show you two different ways that you can prepare and use this treatment i'm gonna keep this so i can use it as a pre poo and i'm gonna put that in the fridge so i can prepare a very beautiful whipped butter now that the mixture cooled down a little bit I am going to add my vitamin E oil and I'm also going to add the essential oil. I'm adding one tablespoon of vitamin E oil and I'm also going to add about two to three drops of tea tree essential oil. 
now as I said I'm gonna keep this one out and I'm gonna put the other one in the fridge few minutes later after the butter solidified a little bit I am now going to whip the butter this treatment is indeed a great treatment i can't finish the video without telling you about moringa moringa has antibacterial and antifungal properties it helps prevent dandruff itchy scalp and eczema it can also delay the growth of gray hair it's rich in vitamin c it has amino acids it can restore the hair it is proven that it can reduce alopecia so moringa can really reactivate the dormant follicles which will boost hair growth on the bald spots another great benefit of moringa is that it's a rich source of biotin it will increase the oxygen supply to the scalp it has omega-3 vitamin a zinc iron which are very essential for hair growth I want to take this time to say thank you so so much to everyone for watching this video i really appreciate it and i want to also say if you are not a subscriber please don't forget to subscribe and turn on your notifications bell so you don't miss another video for me the butter is looking good now i am just going to transfer it into my jar you can see how beautiful is this it's really really beautiful you know you can just use it on your hair as a sealant or you can melt the butter and use it as a pre -poo. that was my original plan just to prepare the mixture and use it as a pre -poo. but you know making diy treatment is addictive i was looking at the mixture and i was like oh that will be a great whipped butter let me try that so this is exactly what i did so if you love butter on your hair you can use that on your hair or as I said, you can just use it as a pre -poo, just like I'm going to use it on the next video. Stay tuned for the next video because you will see how I use it on my hair. And I will also share my full wash day routine. Depending on when you come across this video, you can always check the description box because I will put a link that will take you to watch the next video, the wash day video that's it for the video as i always say you know that i love you so so much because there's a lot of people out there that you can sit down and watch but you decided to give me a few minutes of your precious time it really means the world to me thank you so so much for watching i cannot wait to see you in my next one bye Okay.